Wildcats, I'm Najka. And I'm Justin. Welcome back to WCMS News. Congratulations to Dr. Tucker for being named Teacher of the Month for November. Mr. White was named Employee of the Month. We appreciate all you do. Since getting interested in being on our news team for the third nine weeks, let Ms. Roper or Ms. Smith know. Popcorn will be sold today during lunch for $1. You can also order a Chick-fil-A sandwich t for tomorrow for $4. Christmas is a time to let your imagination soar. Read a fantasy book this month and get invited to our holiday celebration in the media center. Miss Roper will share the favorite books of the season and some of our Oak students will be will play holiday tunes. Show Miss Roper a book completion form to attend. That's all for today. See, See you next time! time. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Uh, if I was an avid student, well, hey everybody, uh, just to say hello to Carver. If I was an avid student, what would be the most difficult thing in staying organized? Wow, um, I think you guys do a great job with keeping the binder. Um, though we can always make some improvements, I think personally, making sure that once I was given papers back that I actually placed holes in them and stuck them and returned them into my binder probably would be the most difficult thing for me to do because <clears throat> as I know like some of you guys do you the book bag seems easier than the notebook and sometimes it gets jammed in there and, and I might have to uh, practice on getting better at that so that would be it. What is your favorite thing about Abbott and how did it progress over the years? My favorite thing about Abbott um, I think my favorite thing about AVID is, as a teacher, the enjoyment students get from learning skills that will help push them to become better than who they already are. Um, I think AVID um, is a blessing to all of us here at the School of Carpers. What is one of your pet peeves about AVID? <clears throat> one of my pet peeves... Mr. Donnelly's pet peeve is um, incomplete homework assignments, especially uh, my TRF assignments. Um, though sometimes Samaya so homework can be frustrating, and you may, as a middle schooler, see it as a distraction. Um, it's building valuable qualities that we all need when one day we either get to college or we become a uh, citizen in the workplace. So. Um, Turning in your homework does more than just make your teacher happy, I promise. How did Carver become an avid school? Carver became an avid school um, about eight or nine years ago. Um, it was brought into uh, this school um, by Dr. Pruitt and some other employees of District 7 to help students at Carver become aware of college, uh, to become ready for college, and to um, help our students here level the playing field and um, become just as successful as everyone else um, in Spartanburg County and throughout South Carolina. Um, uh, we brought AVID as an elective, which is just a class, and over the years we have made it into what it is now a school-wide uh, implementation, uh, which means we make sure everyone is doing AVID here at this school. And also, that's what made us our National Demonstration Site. So we are um, seen throughout the nation as being one of the top schools in Africa. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. No. Uh, we're at Team 8167. I'm Jaden. I'm Stavon. I'm Damien. 
What do you guys like about doing robotics? Well, the fact that we can build any, like, we can add attachments to our robots and that we can build and assemble our robot to do just about anything in the limits, though, but still the fact that you can do anything with the robot is one of the reasons why we like it. This is your robot here? Does he have a name? <laughs> Would you encourage other people to take robotic classes? Yeah, especially if they um, are creative and have good names. All right, thanks, guys.